Kevin O'Sullivan said it in the meeting this morning. For all the struggles, this is the guy he likes late in the game. <laughs> that finds the inside corner. Kind of like the leader of this team behind the plate. The leader in the clubhouse. Not afraid of the big spot. Now down one, two. After that cold strike in the inside part of the plate. Yeah, he didn't like that call and he let John Haggerty know it. Kevin O'Sullivan calls this guy the heart and soul, like you said, Alex. Just a sophomore. In the air. And they're two down. It's just a good job by Howard crowding the inside part of the plate, crowding the right as we talked about the cutting action. Rivera just unable to pull the hands inside enough. Kevin O'Sullivan's team down to its final out. 3 2 game. And there's a strike. India takes the curveball. Red Raiders one out away from the, their first College World Series win in program history. Too high. Aiden Howard ready. And spoiling that one is Jonathan India. See their curveball down in the zone, does a good job. Keeping his hands back, was a little out front, able to fight it off and buy himself another pitch. Right field. Smith racing, diving, can't quite get there. Long run for Steven Smith. That's a great effort. You can see Smith playing that right center gap. It's like a hitter when you hit up off the end, swing off the end of the bat. You smell the hit, he was smelling that out in the <laughs> W. Yep. The Texas Tech. Yeah. Howard ready to work. One, two now. Left field, well struck. Desloni picks it up on a bounce. He's racing for second throw. Out in second. And Texas Tech wins it. Tyler Nesloni guns down Jonathan India, and that's the ball game. First win in program history at the College World Series. And the Gators are that's heading home. One. Here we go. Good Tyler Nesloni doing an outstanding job cutting this ball down the line. That's the first thing you got to do. Avoid the double, he gets down the line, makes the perfect throw, second base, takes a tech, ends up, ends up winning this game. Eric Gutierrez, the senior, with the big home run. Let's take a look at that last play again. Gators down to the final out. And just the presence of mind of cutting this ball off as an outfielder, there's two outs, no doubles. He gets to it, he gets rid of the ball quick, Jonathan India doing what he's supposed to do as a hitter. You got to try to take that sec that back, that second base. It was just a better defensive play from the Sloney. Perfect throw and Texas Tech with the W. I mean, that is a 
great play in the outfield from Tyler Nesloni to end the game. So Florida came back. They end up falling a run short. As we take a look at our Capital One player of the game, Eric Gutierrez goes two out of four, a two-run homer and a single. And Gutierrez, our Capital One player of the game. Great job by the senior and as well. Here today, Davis Martin, tremendous. Jonathan India, the freshman, cut down, trying to stretch the single into a double to end the game. 3-2 the final. We're down to six teams. Texas Tech lives on to fight another day. And the Gators are headed home. The number one national seed. They are eliminated. So Florida is gone. Miami is gone. Still to come tonight, TCU at Coastal Carolina. Another elimination game tomorrow night, 7 Eastern. UCSB and Arizona. And so far, Oklahoma State, our only team, 2-0. That'll change after tonight's game. But we are down to a half dozen. The Florida Gators, one of the favorites to win the 2016 College World Series. And they are done.